So before I get into this video, shout out to Conscious X for finding this one. This is spot on. Make sure you guys go check out his Michael Jackson video. He made an updated version correcting um, his past video. So go check that out. It'll be in the description box below. So today, guys, we're going to be talking about Kendall Jenner and Sandra Bullock. These two characters look exactly alike, as you can see from this side by side. And we're also going to be talking about Rosalind Sanchez. She's a Puerto Rican singer. She's also involved in this group of characters. And she, as you can see, looks exactly like Sandra Bullock, okay? They even have the same smile and everything. Their nose is the same. Their eyes is the same. These two characters are really disgusting because they're really cocky when they know the person's popular in another country and they don't try to cover it up at all. I will start exposing more characters in other countries because people seem to really think that in their country these characters are really, really real and they're actually not. They're as fake as the same ones in the U.S., okay? And they look so much alike, it is crazy. So the main focus in this video is these two characters, but I will dive into this Rosalind character too. So Sandra Bullock, she's this big actor. Um, people should just know the whole rundown with her. And next is Kendall Jenner. And their last name is weird to me. Jenner, it sounds like gender, okay? and her name is Kendall. So if you're a girl and you remember playing with the dolls, the Barbie dolls when you're younger, it sounds like Kendall, like, you know, and the way it's spelled, because there's a lot of girls with that name Kendall, but the way this one is spelled is like Ken doll, like the boy doll, the Barbie doll, okay? That's what she looks like, you know? And like in my previous videos, I've been talking about how these group of sisters, all celebrities really, show that they're the opposite gender so much and they laugh at the idea that people are still going to defend, people are still going to blindly worship, and people are just going to lust over and compare, you know. So next is Rosalind Sanchez. And one thing I want to clear up before we get any further into this video if you come to my channel and if you're new, height does not matter because why would that matter, okay? They're not humans, okay? They're not, they're a question mark. I don't know what the fuck they are, but they're inhabiting, they're entities inhabiting physical form. They're these things that are imitating human vessels. So technology that they have, why does height even matter if they're producing these in quotation human vessels want to be human vessels and they're just recycling the look of other characters why would the height matter either way because i got a lot of people saying well Cher is too tall to be courtney you know still there what the fuck does the height have to do connections don't lie and motherfucking look doesn't lie so what does the height have to do with anything so to all the new people height does not matter on my channel they're not wearing masks and prosthetics. That's a very limiting belief because you would have to... There's so much to account for when you're trying to say it's a mask and prosthetics and it's very limiting and that's not what's going on here. Another thing to clarify and clear up, they can be in the same room because it's not mask and prosthetics. That is so limiting. They can be in the same room because they are recycled looks on these on these blank vessels their looks recycled on these blank vessels okay and they're imitating human format okay that's what's going on here and shout out to the ones who be in the comment section and you have the same thought process as me and conscious acts when it comes to this and you just you just know that there's something deeper to this and it's like what my old banner used to say where open minds reside it's all about openness on this channel. It is not about no fucking limiting ass beliefs that they have to be the same height, that they have to not been in the same room. They can be in the same room. They do not have to be the same height. Who looks alike, looks alike. And who's exact, who has massive connections, that's a connect. That's probably the same 
motherfucking characters, okay? So, back to the video. So, so Rosalind, she is this Puerto Rican singer, songwriter, very popular in Puerto Rico. Here we go, Kendall and Rosalind, side by side. They look exactly alike, too. Rosalind looks so much like Sandra. It is insane. She looks exactly like her. It's like literally a copy-paste. No edits, no, you know, nothing. It's just exactly the same so yeah guys so go check out my kylie jenner video go check out my share is courtney kardashian video and make sure you guys go check out my elvis is chloe kardashian video so here's a side by side of kendall and sandra they have the same look same eyebrows their nose is even similar they look exactly the same they have this pale look to them and these long necks here's kendall and here's sandra they look exactly like even though ken even though kendall has on all this makeup but they still look exact with this blonde hair and something's up with this cross necklace they love wearing these cross necklaces as you've seen from my last video elvis wore it all the time and then chloe she goes and get it tatted on her on her so we have them promoting that a lot and you see regular people getting that tatted on them and here's a side by side the side by side looks exactly alike these two characters you guys can pause it and look at this picture they have the same lips same nose same eyes the only thing is is that kendall is the upgraded version of them she's the modernized version of them so here goes some connections. So Kendall and ASAP Rocky used to date. And of course she's blocking this lady off because that makes it look like the lady's doing one eye, which she is. And Sandra is an actress and Denzel is an actor and they both have wax figures next to each other. And go check out Conscious X video, Denzel Washington's ASAP Rocky. The connection here is that Kendall dated ASAP Rocky and Sandra and Denzel are both actors and actress and they have these wax figures right next to each other. Rihanna dates and in quotations has a kid with ASAP Rocky now and Rihanna and Sandra Bullock are really close. However, her, however, they do this a lot where usually their new character or modern character will either be hated by their old characters friends or friends or whatever or be loved by them the mockery with this is that rihanna does not like kendall okay at all but sandra and rihanna are really close however her new character and her are not cool they're not cordial okay supposedly so she said at kendall don't come to my concert she said that in 2021 but there's also an old tweet of her saying that to her again i don't know why she's repeating that and another weird thing is that they both date the same guy, so that could cause even more beef. And there's still all these videos and articles and stuff from 2022, 2021 about their beef. And right here, this is an old tweet. She said, if Rihanna doesn't perform complicated tomorrow, I'm gonna. And she spelled gonna like that because what happens later, years later, a rapper named Gunna comes out and Rihanna dresses up as him. It's all mockery. It's kind of like they even hint the characters that's going to be out later. And she says, I'm going to be very upset. And then Rihanna says, well, don't come. No context behind that entire thing, but they just don't like each other. So go check out my Rihanna video. I will be making an updated version of this video later. So here's another connection. Sandra kissed Meryl Streep, which is, which is so weird. And if you guys haven't seen Conscious X video, Meryl Streep, she is future and some other characters. And here's Kendall in 2016. She's dancing to Future. She's like Millie Rock in the Future song. Another connection is MGK and Pete Davidson. They crashed Sandra Bullock's Easter party and they brought 40 ounces. Okay, and the connection here, and it's always mockery with the people that they're involved with. So Pete Davidson dates her sister Kim and then MGK. I recently showed him in my Courtney video because Courtney is close. Her and Travis are close to Megan Fox and MGK. So this is pure damage control. Out of all people, why crash her party? And it's kind of like they're just crashing their sister-in-law slash homegirl party. You know, that's what it's coming off as. 
So there's so much to watch with this. I made it simplified, so I broke it down easy. So Sanchez and Sandra both have the same gematria and two ciphers. So English ordinal, they both share 75 and 57. And in the reverse tool reduction cipher, they both share 24 and 42. Next, let's talk about these careers that they be ha having. So two of them are actress and one's a model. They're pretty much all actress if you think about it because the Kardashians, their show, they're pretty much acting. So actress, model, and dead all link up together. So actress and model link up together by having 22 in the same cipher, the four reduction cipher. And then model links to dead by having 49 and 94 in the ordinal ciphers and then dead also equals 22 in reverse full reduction which matches up to model and actress so don't be shocked if models and actresses fake their death you know so model and kindle both share 23 in a full reduction and in reverse full reduction cipher like i've been saying recently in my videos a lot of them are made for the career that they have simple as that and if you ever do the gematria with some career, you know, that they have, whatever person they are, what agenda they push, you'll notice that it always links together. It's like they're just made for that agenda to push and where to infiltrate at and where to sell things to people at. You know, they're made for that one category. There's so many categories to cater towards different types of people. So they make all these characters to cater to that. All right. So, Rosalind and Singer, since she's a singer, they share the same Dramatra, 36, and the same two ciphers that are highlighted. And then Masonry and Jenner both share 33 in a full reduction and reverse full reduction cipher. Jenner and Rosalind Sanchez both share 66. And also, her full name, Rosalind Sanchez, equals 183. These characters, these, this group of characters, someone's gonna die playing out because there's so much gematria like in the 83 or like death or dead you know so don't be shocked and it might be sandra because she has death faker and fake death in the same cipher as her name 43 34 43 as you see from the highlight also her name in the reverse full reduction equals 83 you know so it's all involved it's all scripted okay so one thing that Kendall and Sandra both share is their type of photos, like their aesthetic, I guess you can say. So this is Kendall right now. And Kendall's neck is so big and long and just weird. And here is Sandra. So they both have these two pictures by a car. Here's Kendall. Here's Sandra. And they both have these like same looks. You never really see Kendall wearing a lot of makeup compared to her sister, her sisters, you know. So they just both have the same aesthetic. And this is how they promote stuff to you, okay? This is how they promote things. Um, what I've noticed ever since I did the Dream Doll video, when I seen Tania or Tonight, whatever her name is, uh promoting a product she was doing the horns and as you see she's doing the horns right here trying to promote a versace bag to her fans they're deceiving to the max so right here she's promoting michael kors and she's doing a triangle when they have their arms positioned a certain way really look at their pictures sometimes if you find yourself scrolling and scrambling you're like, you follow them or whoever you are whatever you do look at their pictures and certain poses it equals out to a triangle okay so all of this is a triangle okay and the checkerboard also the flowers and then right here this is how she promoted voting to people um she has voting a triangle flag that's studded and it's black and red of course and then she's promoting a perfume i don't know what brand it was but she's doing the six also on the low and she's also doing a one eye and when they promote things like that, they're literally just saying, fuck you, I can sell you anything. That's literally what's going on. So right here is Rosalind, and Rosalind looks so much like them. Like, I just want to show you guys a bunch of pictures of her. This look exactly like Sandra. It's actually disgusting how much she looks like Sandra, and they just cover that one up. And her body is so weird. Her head is so small. It's like they gave her Sandra's head. 
like completely gave her Sandra's entire face and head and then gave her this dumbass body okay and I'm gonna show you guys her dumbass body because this shit looks crazy her head is too small for her body and here we go her right here and she looks so much like Sandra and another connection is that this is the second time or the third time that I've exposed these sisters so Another connection is that Kylie is based off a Latin descent artist slash painter. And the Courtney whole group of characters, one of her characters is Puerto Rican. And this character right here, this Rosalind character is Puerto Rican. So that's one thing that they're sharing is these Latin characters. And she looks so much like Sandra in this. And this is that body I was talking about. But look at her hands right here. She's doing triangles. They space their hands out purposely like that when they're taking pictures. She's so buff and her head just don't fit her body. It's actually a big joke, as you can see with this. It just looks fake. And this is hot to some people. And here we go. She looks so much like them, especially Kendall with her hair pulled back. She looks exactly like Kendall. And right here, she looks like Kendall. And it looks so much alike. And here's a side-by-side side of Kendall and Sandra. They look so much alike. And one thing I noticed about these two characters, they both are not really involved in makeup. Like, you know, there's a lot of celebrities that wear makeup a lot, but when you look at Kendall and Sandra, they're barely wearing makeup, even younger Sandra. And here is younger Kendall. And I remember in my Courtney video, I talked about how younger Kendall looks so much like a boy even though they all look like boys but her younger baby self doesn't scream i'm a little girl screams i'm a little boy and of course in this picture is half cut off because it's showing chloe aka elvis doing one eye she looks so much like elvis in this picture and here's a side-by-side -side of Sandra and Kylie. They look so much alike. Same nose, same eyebrows, same eyes, lips, everything. They even smile and like in this. Sandra, Kendall, and Rosalind Sanchez. These three characters are the exact same. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you all.